wait, there's a global event everyone is impacted by, which you're talking about, and I can make into a marble race? Well, this is going to be an easy video. If you want more race, I'll give you and I'll give you more race content. And if you want to be there when new videos come out, subscribe and click the bell. Well, there's a global pandemic, which shall not be named, that's in full swing right now. And the rule on the internet is, if something is talked about a lot, then people will make videos about it. There are many people on the news talking about this topic, so I guess I should do it too. I don't have experiences in viruses or pandemics, but I do have experience in model races and how to make them in Algodoo. So, if you're looking for information about this global pandemic, I'm not a doctor, so don't seek professional help from me. However, if you're here to see a model race based off this infectious virus, you're in the right place. Also, expect some jokes in this video, because we can't have a video about this topic without Lyme disease! Too soon? Yeah, probably too soon. We'll be first starting off with a quick round in order to demonstrate how this model race virus will work. The victim, I mean contestants, will be moving around in this makeshift arena. An affected contestant will be coming soon, so the models will not need to repair. No one's washing their hands, so the virus will spread easily. When an infected contestant touches a regular contestant, there's a chance it may pass the virus. Currently, that chance is 1 in 3. Wash your hands! Now all the contestants are infected, you know how this model race works. Just try to stay away from the sick contestants for as long as you can. These 16 contestants will try to outlast the infection in this round. They've started noticing that something is a bit off and started washing their hands while on the course. There is now a 1 in 4 chance that infection will spread. And the infecting contestant is off! Who will fall the virus first this time?
We'll be back after this ad break. Hopefully it won't be boring. Hey you! Are you tired of high quality marble races? Are you sick of the same old professional commentary? Do you want to add a little style to your marble viewing experience? Well, subscribe to our channel and you'll always have marble race videos with questionable quality, unique commentary, always with something happening in the middle of it all. Subscribe today! It'll only cost you 10 easy payments of 000. You had a good run, but all good things must come to an end. And you have surrendered to the virus. The contestant count has dropped by a quarter as some decide that this isn't worth it and don't want to spread the virus. Just kidding, I eliminated them. Hopefully we don't get shut down from hosting these events. The remaining contestants are now vigorously washing their hands and now it's fell down to one six chance. Will the virus be able to spread this time? And it looks like Patient Zero has just fell out from the sky. Who will be first to have the virus be spread to them? We'll be back after another ad break. Brown was able to outplay, outwit, but not at last, as they again fall to the victim to the virus. Well, that went quick, didn't it? This is what can happen when a global pandemic is allowed to spread without intervention. No one wins in this moral race because no one wins in a pandemic. This may be a simulation, but it's happening in real life, right now. Before you leave, remember to do these five things issued by the World Health Organization in order to slow down this spread of the disease. One, wash your hands. Two, cough into your elbow. Three, don't touch your face. Four, 
Keep a distance away from other people, especially if they're sick. And five, stay home if you feel sick. So that's my PSA to you guys. Stay safe. In the meantime, I'll just be here hoarding rolls of paper used for wiping my bottom because the last thing you want when you're in a survival situation is to have a good toilet experience, right?